So I'm working on my uh, 2002 Audi A4 1.8 liter turbo and I've had an issue with the vacuum pump and the brakes not working right for a while now. Um, but here's some tips on what you should know. Basically, your vacuum pump is controlled with this fuse. It's fuse number nine. It's a little 15 amp fuse. Um, it's listed for the radiator fan, but uh, it's actually gonna be the fuse that also controls that little pump. And that little pump is that right there, that vacuum pump. Um, the relay that controls that is number 373. You can kind of see it through this hole right here. Um, you'll want to check that relay as well if your fuse is good. And there's a video on that. Maybe I'll just include it in the end of this video. But it's right under here under the dash, that 373. should be um, relay number four in the bank. So there's a bank of relays that kind of in a row there. And it's the fourth one to the right. So yeah, check that fuse, check that relay. And then you can actually feel your pump and have someone like push the pedal the brake pedal while well, you feel the pump to see if it actually buzzes and like turns on. All right, so I'm gonna try and show you how you can see a relay turn on and off. As you can see here, I've taken off the little cover and I've been testing this relay. But what's nice is you can just plug the relay back in uh, while the cover's off so that you can actually see it activate. This is for the brake vacuum pump. So I'm actually gonna push the brake pedal with my hand and you'll see it turn on. So see how that clicked down? And you can hear the pump running. It's kind of buzzing in the engine bay. And so I know that relay's good. And then it just turned off and I can do it again. Push the brake with my hand. Clicks on, clicks off. So that's kind of a good way to test a relay if you don't have a lot of tools.